Hello, happy uh, community day week and homecoming week. Um, I want to show you two resources today that I've been referring to a lot of students to make sure you have um, easy access to them. Number one is the library. This is the library main page, which is available through the uh, My CSS Help and Resources Library. And on this front page um, is a request a help from a librarian, it's similar to like our ask a question. If you've not asked a librarian a question, I highly recommend you do for your next paper or research project. It is a great way to get started. So if you find yourself super procrastinating, finding resources, um, narrowing down topics, I recommend you submit a question just to break that ice of the procrastination and to see what somebody else who's working with students all day on these topics might have for ideas for you. So it's super easy from the user perspective, you and the student. I would recommend even filling this out with a student and putting in a question such as, I need help finding resources connecting yoga to Hinduism, for example. Um, and the student just has to put in their email and submit and get a response via their CSS email. Fabulous resource. I don't think enough students use that resource. The next is the Writing Center. So the Writing Center are neighbors, right? Um, they are also available in my CSS under, of course, this Help and Resources Academic Support Writing Center. Writing centers are not something that exists in a lot of high schoolers, high schools. So students might need an intro to what the Writing Center is and why should they use it. And this is a great time to refer them to this page, as well as then on here, they have a link to their own um, Google site that you can show students. Um, you can either schedule an appointment with a student or submit a draft online. If you have a draft that's like kind of polished and you're like, I would like some just a quick review, um, submitting a draft online makes makes sense. But I will say to get the most bang for your buck, um, actually sitting down with a writing consultant um, is going to help a student no matter where they're at in their writing development and wherever they are at at their paper. You can never go to the writing center too early or too late. They can help you in the final stages. They can help you um, if you've just gotten the prompt, you have no idea where to get started. It's a really awesome, comprehensive service available to all students here for all classes. So to learn more about their services, take some time to look at their website yourself so you're prepared to talk about the service and refer students. And you're, of course, welcome to walk people down um, to 2121. There is a schedule, there is a, you know, make an appointment, but it's all staff during the day. So if there is no appointment, um, it's okay, drop by and they might be able to walk, have somebody walk in. So scheduling, um, they can also do Zoom sessions, do a um, online submit feedback form and then tutor.com resources for grad students and ELL students. And then it's also helpful for our students to know who is working with them, who can they expect to get to work with in the Writing Center. So you can see their friendly faces. Um, they are undergrad students and the top two were professional staff of various majors um, around campus. So fabulous, fabulous resource. Again, available um, under Help and Resources, Academic Support, it's probably your best bet in terms of finding them. Writing assistance. If you have not used the Writing Center, um, I challenge you to use it for your next paper, whether you've thought of yourself as a good writer um, or somebody who's struggled in that area, they can help you become a better writer and meet your goals. Um, a lot of times students feel nervous about using the Writing Center, feeling like, um, they might be judged or they're not good enough to use the Writing Center. And in those cases, sometimes students want to use tutor.com to submit a paper to somebody who um, isn't here. And that's fine, too. Um, but know that it is a, a process that takes some maturity and um, will only help long-term academic goals by using their services. So I challenge you to check them out for your next paper. I'll see you around. Thanks so much, y'all.